Alrighty, we are back. I'm going to be attempting to take out a uh, ruby weapon now as my save files are sinking. And uh, we are going to see what we can do. I'm running sort of a similar setup as I did with Emerald. I swapped out fire armlets for the Zedrix because, uh, if I remember correctly, I remember that ruby likes to use fire attacks. So uh, every fire attack is going to just heal me now. Ribbons, because ribbons are important in this one, because uh, they are going to prevent a lot of status ailments that Ruby Weapon can actually use. Ultimate weapons on everyone, again. Uh, some differences, still have Phoenix final attack on everyone. Uh, Master Summon with HP Absorb, so if I do summon something, and I'll probably be using Hades, because that, in that induces status effects, which Ruby is actually susceptible to. So I'll be using that a little bit. I'm still going to be going through without KOTOR, uh, again, but... Uh, We'll get that going on the way. That's also, you can use KOTOR. Uh, he, Ruby counterattacks KOTOR and your physical attacks occasionally. Like those two attacks specifically. He'll counterattack with Ultima. But if you use Hades before you use Knights of the Round, it'll actually just go through and he won't counterattack at all because he'll be uh, a status the a status element. I think it's Peral. No, I can't remember. I can't remember the status element that's thrown onto it, but it stops him from counterattacking it. And so if you have W Summon, you can just W Summon Hades uh, Knights of the Round and just wipe Ruby quickly. But I'm going to not use that strat because I want to just beat him legit without a, that. I'm going to figure out something on my own, basically. So I got uh, HP Absorbs on two people. I only had two HP Absorbs, so I threw a quad cut on, see if I'll use that at some point. I got, I'm, I'm apparently told it is paralysis. I was uh, mumbling correctly. Got W Summon on everyone. Uh, Master Command on everyone. Uh, HP Plus to quad nine it. Uh, counter Attacks. Again, uh, enemy skill on Cloud this time, Mega all on Red 13, W Magic on Sid still, those are the, that and the double cut are the only out outliers from the three characters. Long range on everyone, Quad Magic, I think I'm good. Equipment wise, the Fire Armlet already went over all that stuff, we're going! Uh, you can run into him with uh, Chocobo or with uh, High Wind. I chose High Wind, just because. <clears throat> Alrighty, we are trying this again. So, this time you'll notice I have two dead party members. This is a little bit of a neat little thing. What this is going to do is it's going to force him to put his tentacles on the ground right away. And it's actually going to stop him from being able to use his, uh... One sec here. It's going to stop him from being able to use his attack that will, uh... Uh... Kick my party members out of the party. Out of the game, out of the fight. Last, I, this is my second attempt at him. The first attempt, uh, both Cloud and Sid got knocked out of the fight permanently. And uh, when when the party's down to one person and one person only, uh, he will throw his hands into the ground and tentacles will come up behind you. And uh, bam, I will. Uh, it doesn't. Uh, holy crap! It did a lot of damage. Back attacks and all. <clears throat> Oh yeah, that's basically just what happened. I needed to uh, have the uh, part. Oh, yeah, as long as his hands are in the ground, he can't kick my party members out of the fight. <clears throat> and now I'm trying to come up with strategies that'll actually defeat him. No, not manipulate. What the hell am I doing? I'm missing a lot. I'm trying to think of something I can do. Uh, hey Siglo, I'm using a component cable. I don't use HDMI because of the HDCP on the PS3s. <clears throat> Let's see. Um, what the hell am I gonna do? I'm trying to think of a strategy here. Well, let's use. Hades and <laughs> because it's hilarious, I can use Jacobo. <laughs> oh, my mouse is on the screen. Sorry. <clears throat> I still have no idea what I'm gonna do here. Um, I don't want to use Kotor still.
so that puts stop on him. Death blow! <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking of throwing money at him. That might just be my best bet. Ow. How much money can I throw at him without having him do... I think I need to be a hundred. Oh shit, he has Shadow Flare. Right. That can be reflected. Okay, so I'm gonna be using Mega Elixirs to keep my MP up just for Phoenix to work if I actually do get start to get killed. Quad magic! Wonderful! Good for you. I love you, quad magic. Note to self, make Cloud use the rest of his reflects right away. Ow. Is he gonna counter that every time? Hades saying is like <laughs> See he's actually imitating Devin and I during the Halo playthrough whenever we saw a ghost. <clears throat> I just used Bahamut Zero because he's awesome. And that and last fight when I used him got cut, so Cloud's fine. No need to worry. See? <clears throat> you guys are worrying too much. Money! Oh, he's moving again. I have to be quick with this. Okay, here we go. So, Hades. Let's use Typhon instead. Coin. And then I'm going to use Mime right after. Mime should imitate this, shouldn't it? I'm not sure how Mime is going to work with Coin. I'm not sure how Mime is going to act with coin. Timber! That healed him, okay? Good to know. And Mime... Imitated. 
Good. Okay, note to self, do not use, uh, the thing. I think I'll just use Chocomog, because it's quick. Yes, I read the com the chat. Hello. This battle's gonna take a while. Hope you guys have some popcorn or something. <clears throat> okay, he starts moving after every attack. He didn't use the Ultima, Ultima that time, though. That's fine. Sweet, thanks for the heal. Love this noise. Look at all that damage from that useless attack. He's not moving. Nope, he's moving. <laughs> Damn it, I don't get much time here. <clears throat> Let's use another cool attack. Don't worry, guys. The Ruby has 200,000 less health than Emerald. It's we got this. <laughs> Or two million left, or I don't know, you know, two hundred thousand, I think, less. Howling Moon. That won't end horribly. And I accidentally didn't use coin before this. I meant to mime coin, not mime uh, the spell, the mad, the summons.
Just letting you guys know, this battle's gonna take a long time and it's gonna be full of Hades. Wait, what? 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 Okay, Kotar is being used now to see how much damage it's going to do. I'm not sure how much damage KOTOR does. Oh god, I'm just gonna use KOTOR. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Not out of, like, just out of the fact that it does more damage than anything else I got. Yeah, if he's gonna, like, be dumb and take out my characters like that, I'm just gonna use KOTOR. I'll just use the cheap strat. Oh, KOTOR ignores defense. I forgot about that. <clears throat> Okay then, well, it's gonna be the Hades Kotor uh, combo from now on. So I hope you're all ready for this. <laughs> I hope you're ready for lots of oohs, followed by big knights smashing this red thing into the ground repeatedly. Oop, pushed a button. Pushing buttons. Where's my targets? Oh, targets doesn't show up. Target? Oh, no target. There are other strategies, like using coin would be good, but it's just going to take way too long for my liking, so. <clears throat> uh, Luna, he will, uh, he can counter attack between summons with a W summon. W summon doesn't cast one after another. It is literally it just does two turns, like two standard attacks. Like it would be the same as one of my characters being able to do a physical normal attack twice in a row. It would just be attack, then it has a chance to counter. And then I attack again and then it has another chance to counter. So using Hades first is almost mandatory. It is mandatory, or else I'm going to be countered with uh, Ultima every time. Huh. 
Actually, if I just use mime repeatedly now, I win. Because I can mime it, which doesn't use MP, I don't think. And if that's the case, I'm going to win just because I got HP Absorb on Master Materials. Luna, everyone has Mime. <laughs> Actually, technically nobody has Mime. Everyone has Master Command. And Master Command has Mime. And Manipulate, and Death Blow, and Steal, and Sense, and Throw, and Coin, and Morph, and, uh, that's it. Enemy skills, another material. I am the ghost of Christmas past. You have been a very naughty boy. You shall be punished. Yeah, like, I actually, like, my backup strat was this. <laughs> I tried. I tried, guys, to have another, like, strategy that I felt comfortable with. I tried a couple of other things, but I always had this in my back pocket with the setup I had with my materia, just in case things went awry. <clears throat> I'm actually lucky that Sid was the one knocked out, because Sid didn't, doesn't have HP absorb on the materia. I'm pretty sure Red 13 should get healed from this. <clears throat> Looks like the ghost of Christmas future. Bam. Healed. Yeah, I have uh, one. This is just going to be the same thing over and over and over again. For those of you on YouTube who don't really care, you can just skip to the end of the video now. <laughs> okay, now my defense for this, only because of the damn video. I would have tried, like, if I wasn't doing the YouTube video, I would have actually tried to come up with another strat. Like, normally. And then eventually I probably would have given up and just resulted to this. I would have tried a little bit harder to come up with something. But when he knocked Sid out, I was like, well, he's just going against everything that I knew, thought I knew about him. So I am just going to uh, use the cheap strat on him. <clears throat> Spin move! Fire move! Thank God that doesn't heal. Hammer of Justice. I think that was like a, a shimitar or something. Ice move! Spin move! That was another lance. This is Comet? Medio! Actually, no. It's me not Medio. Medio is currently trying to drop and kill the planet. Axe of Smash! Boom, and a big slash on him. <laughs> Beat him by flipping the pool. <laughs> Of course, this is actually assuming you get the gold Chocobo.
because you need to uh, you need to go Jacobo for a nice of the round. So that's the only way this strategy would work. <clears throat> I haven't watched Clone High in who knows how long. I should rewatch it. Gashi! Yeah, after this, I don't know what I'm gonna do after this. This took a lot longer than I was hoping it would. The Emerald fight took about as long as I thought it might. <clears throat> this fight's taking a lot longer than I thought it was going to. Although it's gonna be over before too, too long here. With all these attacks I'm using. Oh, apparently it unfroze itself? Whatever, okay. Somehow it didn't get paralyzed in that hit or something. I don't know. Zillia should be continuing tomorrow. Yeah, I think Ruby's cheating. He should have been paralyzed and not able to attack me there. <clears throat> Ron is OP, but I don't like using him in fights because he's slow. He doesn't agree with my fighting style on those games. Foot him up! Oh man, I forgot about that. I'm footing him up hard right now. <clears throat> oh, it doesn't matter if uh, he takes out another party member with this strategy. This is a solo strat. Doesn't matter which character he actually takes out now either. He, he's gonna die no matter what now. If he knocks out a second party member, my third party member can solo him with this strat. That HP absorb is such a good materia. I like how the pillar just goes straight through his hand. Rowan is a character in Tales of Zillia. You're wondering where the chandelier hangs from. I'd be more wondering where all these knights are flying in from. Like, at least, uh... Like, this is like a different time and space. How are these knights existing? Like, Hades is an undead god of the underworld. He can just pop in whenever he wants to, but these guys are actually supposed to be people. <laughs> Add to the fact that I have no idea how they're able to use these attacks.
They're humans. They're not using materia. They're using, like, physical attacks. No human should be this tall! He's taller than Ruby! Twice as tall as Ruby! King Arthur is actually a giant. Nailed it. Got it before it went away. <clears throat> so after this, the only achievement I have left is the Materia Overlord achievement. Which, technically, I have, like, one materia, or, uh, like, a handful of materia progress towards right now. I actually have to go and remaster every summon, magic, command. I need to go do all the independent materia, or mo some of the independent materials. I actually have quite a few done. I still need to go get a couple of other materia I haven't picked up yet, either. He gives no feet. It's feet, Will. It's feet. No one gives a foot. Old jokes from stream past. Coming to fruition here tonight. He gives no foots. He gives no feet. Hey look, he got slashed in the head again. Is he dead yet? That's gotta be like eight uses of that attack now. Yay! Ba da 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 ba da Quadra magic level up. <laughs> Sweet. <clears throat> That is a cool icon for that achievement. Do 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 ba -na -na -ba -na -ba -na. Sorry, I just sort of parked my airship into your house. My bad. My B Anyways, we got the uh desert rose for that. And with the Desert Rose, we are able to get another item from you. Desert Rose, you want to trade it for Chocobo? Sure, trade! I got Chocobo! Hey look, it's gold. It's a Chocobo, take it, it's yours! I must go. My planet needs me. What should I name it? Hmm. I already got shiny. Um. Shiny and glint. It's a form of shiny. Glunt! It's Glint! Also goes to White Glint. Come on, Shiny! Hey look, guys, let's go to the KOTOR cave now that we have a Shiny Gold Chocobo. Anyways, those are the two Ultima... Ultimate bosses of the game done. Yay. Woot, if you missed the Emerald fight, go watch that. Or watch it on YouTube. Or if you're, uh, you came into the late to the stream and missed me killing an Emerald without using a cheap KOTOR strat, go ahead. And you, but uh, that's going to be it for me for this game. The only achievement I'm missing is the uh, Materia Overlord achievement. But uh, I'm not 
planning to do that on stream. So that's all. That's going to be it for Final Fantasy VII. So uh, thanks to everyone for watching, and uh, have a good one. Talk to you all later. Bye.